What's up guys, welcome to a block and a min with the thermal expansion redstone plates. So there are two different types of redstone plates, the basic ones and then the charge ones. We'll start with going over plate mechanics. So when you place it down, the area of the block that you place it on determines the original orientation. Um, to switch to the orientations, you can right click with a crescent hammer and to open the GUI, you shift right click with a multimeter. The charge plate GUI is more simple. It only has one button that toggles between charged players and items and charging players only. The redstone plate GUI is more complicated. It has the distance from where the signal originates. It has the strength of the signal and has the duration and ticks of the signal as well as an orientation tab. So this is a distance of one, distance of three, distance of five. This is a distance of one with a strength of three. This is a distance of one with a strength of six. This one lasts for two ticks, and this one lasts for 20 ticks. Thanks for watching the basics of redstone plates. Check out the other plates here.